First, let's retrieve the previously issued e-ticket details stored in the PNR. Using the TWD transaction, followed by slash L, line identifier, followed by 8, specifies line 8 of the PNR, where the FA e-ticket record is stored. Press Enter. Next, to insert the original issued e-ticket details into the PNR for reissue, use the FO original issued in exchange identifier. Enter the display sign, followed by letter L, and the line number 8, corresponding to the issued e-ticket in the PNR. Then slash P1 for the passenger number 1, and slash letter S, segment identifier, followed by 4-5, indicating the specific itinerary segments to be reissued. Press Enter to proceed. After the FO line is displayed, place the cursor at the end of the line and press Enter again to confirm. The FO, original issued, e-ticket data will now be updated and appear as line 12 in the PNR elements. To update the payment details, first clear outdated forms of payment from the PNR. To remove the existing form of payment, use the XE, cancel element, command, followed by 13 to 14 to remove lines 13 and 14 from the PNR. Press Enter to delete these entries. Now, apply the updated payment method combining the original invoice and new charges. Use the FP, form of payment, command followed by letter O, original form of payment identifier. Then slash INV to show the invoice payment method used when the ticket was first issued. Then plus sign slash INV, indicate the invoice new payment method for penalty fee. Then slash ETB 7589, 